Hey guys, thanks for joining me. Just wanted to do, uh, you know, hopefully a short video. My favorite Peterson pipe shape is uh, a 606 Army mount. Um, so I have four of them here that I wanted to show you, and they're all rusticated a little bit differently. And uh, I wanted to kind of go over how that affects the size of the pipe. Um, and anyways, I like talking about 606s because, like I said, it's my favorite pipe shape. So, um, I'll start with this one here. So, this is the 606 Ashford. Very nice, smooth finish. It's got kind of a Cumberland-looking acrylic. Uh, this is a silver band. You can see nice, thick walls. Um, really great pipe. I love how I like their straight pipes. I'm not a big system guy. Um, so the straight pipes are my preference. I like the way they just hang. Um, so that one gives you an idea of just kind of the 606 is a nice hearty, not overly huge, but kind of a nice thick pot. So that brings us, I guess I'll go to this one next. This is the 606 in the summertime finish. Obviously I do have a softy bit on here. Um, so it's got kind of a white and yellow acrylic stem, um, nickel band on this one. And this one actually has a sandblast. So you still retain most of the briar, um, but it gives you a nice texture. Um, and it's nice and true to its name. I think this goes great in the summertime. Kind of a cool pipe. This is my most recent acquisition. I uh, picked it up at a brick and mortar that I had a gift certificate from uh, that my sister gave me. So uh, I don't know if you'd be able to see the bottom, but you know, they got Peterson stamping summertime 606. So that brings me to the next one, probably my favorite of the four. So this is the 2019 um, Christmas. So you can see it's kind of a brownish Cumberland with the P, uh, silver band again. And this one's rusticated. Still keep most of the briar. Um, it's got a nice dark finish. My dog's whining. Hold on a second. Say hi, Belle. Yeah. So like I said, this is probably my favorite of the four. I like the rustication. It's almost like a, a sandblast, but a little bit more gnarly. Um, I like the silver band. Um, awesome pipe. Interestingly, the North American version of this had the copper band. So it was like this pipe with a copper band. Um, I have a 107 like that. Um, but uh, I wanted the silver, so I ordered from GQ Tobaccos in England. Unfortunately, they're not able to ship tobacco but you can still buy pipes from them. So I got the 2019 with the silver band, uh, European edition. And then the last one I have is the 606 in the Derry, D-E-R-R-Y finish. So it's got a light brown kind of uh, acrylic nickel band, um, and, but very deep rustication. Uh, which I like, but it does diminish the amount of briar, and they also kind of bevel the inside on this one, uh, just the, the top of the bowl. Uh, so if you compare that, I, again, I like the thick pot kind of uh, proportions. You can see you do lose quite a bit of briar. It's a considerably smaller pipe. So that's just something to consider if you have a pipe shape that you really like but you wish it were a little bit bigger a little bit smaller sometimes you can you know i typically like 
rusticated pipes, but if I wanted something um, a little bit bigger, you could go with the uh, smooth finish. Um, or if you like a pipe but you were, wish it was just a little bit smaller, uh, you could go with something that has lots of rustication. Deep rustication. You can see it's really pretty deep and gnarly in some places. So like, I've got an 80S, um, and I like that. It's just a hair small. And then um, I had an XL15, which is kind of the big brother of the 80S. Uh, and that one was just a little bit large. And so I think, you know, if I wanted to find the sweet spot there, um, I you know, you could maybe find the XL15 if they made it in a, you know, deep rustication. So... Um, that's kind of my takeaway there. Uh, I like all my 606s. If I were to part with one, you know, as much as I like the, the deep rustication look, it, you do lose a lot of the size. This is, you know, a little, yeah, I'm sure the bowl size is the same, but just appearance-wise, aesthetically, it's kind of a smaller pipe. And again, I like the thicker proportions of the pot. So, anyways, those are my thoughts. I love the 606. I know, um, I've mentioned him a few times on my channel, 13 Pipes has this exact pipe. Uh, you've probably seen him smoke this a lot. Um, great pipe. That was my first one. Uh, and then, uh, then the Ashford. I got this dairy uh, for a good price used on eBay. And then again, this one was a pipe shop. So, hope you found that interested. Um, my favorite pipe shape. Thanks for watching, guys. I'll talk to you again soon. Take care.